102 day 102 on the trail i'm in some uh frog tog and some loner clothes heading out to the laundromat today oh, oh i'm still at the uh the, the, the i think it's called the grace lutheran hiker hostel and i'm staying taking a zero today and coming back tonight because they're having a meal a home-cooked meal i like food so coming back for that but so taking a zero today but they kick everybody out at nine we can't just like hang around and be bums you know, all day, so I'm going to go out. Oh, I got a bus pass. About to take the bus around Waynesboro, go to the laundromat, post office, library. You got to go buy Stanimals. You got errands to run today, so today's an errand running day. It'll be fun. Y'all hang around. Had, um, Time to do laundry. My clothes are getting clean. And it really wasn't that expensive because we, sp we split it three ways, which works out. $3 a piece when you get clean clothes, and I wash in everything. Like right now, I'm wearing a, a rain jacket and, and some shorts. It's going to be nice. I'm styling and profiling at the Hiker Mecca, the promised land. Um, um, whatever you want to call it. Walmart, man. Walmart. <laughs> I fit right in. Actually, I look kind of bad, but <laughs> you know, I'm gonna go get some uh, fuel. Go get some fuel. Oh, and I'm looking. I'm trying to call the. Uh, it's called the Shenandoah Art Center here in Waynesboro, and and they have art exhibits. And if it's free, I want to go today because I'm staying. It's a zero day. If it's free, I'm gonna go to it. And then later tonight, Thursday night, they have a park and they have a free concert tonight. What? So maybe the art center, free concert, and then we get a free meal back at the hostel. Man, I have to take it zero. I can't turn that down. Where am I going? I need to go like to the outdoor section. Not the books and magazines section. We got a book here a while ago back at uh, Franklin, North Carolina. What was that book? The Song of Achilles. Whew. Whew, that was bad. That was bad. I got the first, like, second paragraph. I'm horrible. I'd throw that thing away. And anyway, let me go find Camp Fuel. Bye. Check this out. They have, they actually have the isobutane and it's only 547. I know it's the bigger can, but I like the bigger can because it's cheaper. And if Walmart's selling it for 547, you know, if you go to like a, uh, what are those places called? Outfitters, they, they sell them for like 12, 15 bucks for this. What? Walmart's making a profit at 547. I know economy is scale, but still they're charging triple the price. Their profit margin must be huge. Must be huge. Anyway, got fuel, baby. I don't know if y'all can see what I'm seeing. Oh, she turned. I gotta get out of Walmart, man. I'm gonna get in trouble here. Look, I know I'm disgusting. I know I am. I'm a dirty, nasty hiker, but I have standards. Y'all see that? It's wrong. I know I'm disgusting. I know I'm a dirty, nasty hiker, but I do have standards. I just went into the Walmart restroom. <sighs> Couldn't believe my eyes. Someone went number two in the urinal. Like, yeah, yeah. Woo! Get me back out in the woods. I don't like society anymore. <laughs> Clothes are in. The dryer, yay. Ah, it's gonna be a good day today. Eating a payday. I've grown to appreciate the flavor of a payday candy bar. And a good thing about a payday, it's got peanuts over the caramel and it doesn't melt. So you can put it in your bag and carry it with you. Anyway, our laundry's done, but Delaney who's with us, well, well we're just traveling around together. For some reason, the Walmart wouldn't take her Apple Pay, and so a, a nice lady in the in the in the laundromat was riding her up to Target because Target takes Apple Pay. Target is in the 21st century. 
Walmart, Walmart's just trying to like edge Apple out of their financial transaction market because Walmart wants to collect the data and they don't want to, then they want to sell it to Apple. You know, it's all, it's all a data thing. All that money, money, big money. Anyway, so we're just waiting for Delaney to come back and then I'm gonna go to uh, um, Stanimals to get a pot that's being held for us and then to the art center and then to the library and then back to the hostel for dinner and then there's a free concert being held tonight from 6 to 8 p.m down at the park and if, if it, i'm hoping to get to the concert but we, it may interfere with the the dinner so i'd i'd put food first but it's something like uh, i forgot the name of the band but it looks like a cool jazz band or something you know i i haven't heard live music in a long time so i'd love to go to that so stay tuned it's gonna be an exciting day it's always wonderful. My name is there. Check this out. We're at the uh, Shenandoah Valley Art Center. Look at this guy. The, the gallery's in transition, so they haven't uh, hung all the, the pictures and paintings. But, and, and this exhibit that they have now is all of the, the members. It's, it's not, they're not professional artists, but they're still artists. And, it's cool art, so we're gonna walk around and check it out. I enjoy I enjoy places like this. All right, so far this is my favorite one. It looks like you're going into a man's closet, and you have the bowl. Oh, now that is kind of realistic. Well, it's ooh, that's neat. Oh yeah. I love looking at art. But this bull. That's like a Hemingway novel. This is a neat place. <laughs> oh, no, no, you're okay. You can be in the picture. I'm sorry. You good? I'm sorry. I wonder if it could. We have no idea. More art. This is a. I like him. Let's see this. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's really cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's cool. It's like you have this whole space, and then the guy at the very end. That's how I feel sometimes. I'm like I'm a fisherman walking the sand. And you have the depths out here. And you can't really look into the depths and understand them. You can only imagine. But sometimes the waves wash pretty seashells up on the shore and you find them. It's like memories of the, of the deep. On the top floor, it looks like these are studios. Like artists are like artists in, in residence. So like this artist, you know, enjoy looking, but please don't touch the work. And this is there. This is where they work. And when an artist is here, you can sit and watch them like make art. I feel like I'm like traveling. I don't know, it seems like a very intimate place that I maybe shouldn't be, but I, I enjoy looking into it. Oh, I don't know if I can show all this art on YouTube. Well, y'all are adults, man, it's artwork. Just don't touch anything. Touch it with your mind. Oh, that is neat. Yeah. That is neat. So you, you like crafts? Uh, you, you put like 
it's, it's not a kit. Like you're cutting all the pieces out and putting them together. Oh yeah, no, 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 it's not a kit. No, I built it from scratch. Yeah. Whoa. Except like I so I hate it. I'm so grumpy with it. I tried making my snake from scratch over here. You can yeah. sort of see it's like this ugly thing. And I was like, you know what? Oh, this snake right here. here. Oh no. I really snakes and just modify it because why do you do all that hard work? Oh, so. it looks. That, he's is he finished? Not well. Or or, or it, it, he looks good. You do these things and you're like, nah, you know, like yeah. I like this head. I don't like any part of the mouse. So oh. so those are those parts, and then the boxes. The boxes. They're gonna contain also like this one. So I'm buying up um, old tablets. Oh. So the tablets are gonna go in here and okay. play a film. So they'll hang, and then you can watch the film. Sort of house oh. the boxes. Yeah. That's so, neat. Yeah. Because uh, I have an art exhibit coming up in November. So, okay. Of course, instead of doing what most people would do and painting a lot, I was like, I'm not in a painting mood. Fuck this. <laughs> I'm going to teach myself how to make weird machines that are useless. Oh. So. Uh, see, they're automatons. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. so, 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 here, I'll, I'll run this for you. You can do it too. It's pretty fun. That is, I mean, these are the things we tried to avoid on the trail. <laughs> but, but he's moving like a real snake. I like that. Yeah, that's that, is, that is very neat. Yeah. When I see you, he's like, yeah, just like found you know, objects. Just found objects, like nothing, nothing really fancy. But you put it all together, and it's you have the snake. That's part and of the point of it. Oh. I was talking to the uh, woman who runs the art center. And I think yeah, a lot of my artwork and a lot of just who I am is about exposing what's underneath. I'd rather have like the mechanisms visible and stuff. Oh, the mechanisms! You can so you're not just seeing the snake move; you're seeing what makes the snake move. Right. So it's sort of this intentionality about that. Very nice art. Very nice art. I like this one. Ooh, I gotta pay attention. I can dig this. I don't have a lot of like deep emotional things to say about the art, but. I can sit and look at it. That's pretty good. Okay, they're starting to transit. The transitioning is happening. The art is going on the wall. I like the bull. Reminds me of a Hemingway novel. I love Hemingway, so if I see a bull, especially uh, uh, the sun also rises. Bullfighting. He was big on bullfighting. And I also like. Oh, this is big. I like this one. It's like man's closet. All the ties. And you can't. They are actual ties. It, this is not painted. These are like lacquered. They're all lacquered. That is pretty neat. Because I was looking at it, they look 3D. I don't know if y'all can see. Yeah, it's not just. It's not just. Anyway, anyway. I'm talking too much. I'm hungry. Hungry and tired. Time to go to the library next. So we're back at the library, and I just wanted something to read for a little bit. Found uh, Thoreau, Henry David Thoreau, Walden Pond. I like Walden Pond. I like the idea of it, but I didn't know that Thoreau tried to climb Mount Katahdin. Guess what I'm trying to do? Climb Mount Katahdin at the end of the Appalachian Trail. All right, y'all check this out. Check this out. All right. I'm gonna find the picture. So Henry David Thoreau attempted twice to climb Mount Katahdin in Maine. Check this out. Uh, 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 right there. That's what he's trying to do. That's where I'm going. That's where I'm going. He tried to go there. But unlike Henry David Thoreau, Heisenberg's going to climb Mount Katahdin. I'm so tired, I need coffee. I can't read this book right now. Sorry, throw, you're just a little dry. And when, <laughs> yeah, I need coffee and food. All I want right now is coffee. I'm going through withdrawals. 
picked up a triceratops here. That thing is big, and, and it just makes me think, like, it, I mean, look how big it is. Like, what if you're hiking the Appalachian Trail, and this just, like, runs down the mountain? That thing's huge. I mean, we're, we, I'm worried about a bear, but the, the, the bear is going to be worried about the triceratops. I don't know. I'm not really thinking straight. I'm tired. I need coffee. I forgot to show y'all, man. I've been neglecting the YouTube. I'll just show you the leftovers here at the Grace Lutheran. I'm sorry, I'm tired. But we had a spaghetti dinner tonight. Excellent spaghetti. Delicious. Salad to go with it and a good salad. I had like cherry tomatoes, radishes, carrots, cheese, dressing, a delicious salad. Delicious spaghetti. Then we had brownies and fudge swirl ice cream for dessert. And and if you look right here, lemonade and tea. I made Arnold Palmer pa Arnold Palmer's art all night. <laughs> Tired. Anyway, I mean like look. Look, this is what's we still have spaghetti left over. Like I'm gonna wake up at one o'clock in the morning to make more. And then there's some salad left. We, we we run through salad because out here I mean when you're hiking you want vegetables. Uh, I've just eaten my uh, third plate, third plate, and I mean, I'm talking about like big plates. And in about 20 minutes, I'm going to eat another plate. Anyway, uh, Luther, I mean, Grace Lutheran, or Hope Grace Lutheran, I mean, Lutheran Church. <sighs> Thank you. It was amazing. And then we had a little chapel service up there at 11. That was, it was very intimate, small service. We sang two hymns and, you know, had a prayer. It was nice. <sighs> It's good camping here tonight staying here tonight it's it is too nice it's too nice to leave i almost don't want to get back on the trail then the library over there tomorrow i'm gonna i'm, I'm taking another day off i'm gonna sit over there and read i just that's what i love to do my beard's growing back anyway hey i'll see y'all next time i'm gonna go to sleep Go set up my tent. I don't know if you always see me. Stop. <laughs> I mean, get my stuff up. Set up right here. Um, we're still all getting set up. But it's nice. And then there's snacks in the hiker lounge. Have I showed you all the hiker lounge yet? Snacks. Any kind of snack. Fruit. Milk. Cereal. Bars. Candy. Coffee. Every thing i mean this is one kitchen and then there's another kitchen another full kitchen up there <sighs> hey if you are a backpacker and you're hiking the appalachian trail uh don't stay at stanimals I mean, oh, oh but thank you oh stanimals stanimals very kind guy uh the guy running it uh what's the name bugs bugs like bugs bunny he was he was the manager there yeah I mean, nice nicest guy he let us like go through the hiker box and everything and let us hang out and uh, cool guy it's not my scene St. Elmo's it has its own scene it's not my scene this is more my scene it's like relaxed and people are kind and quiet it's there's people i like to hang out with i'll hang out with anybody anyway thank you St. Elmo's for for offering to, to host us for a work for stay i'm so tired i will see y'all next time tomorrow we'll do something fun i don't know i'll think of something do something fun bye Time to go to bed. I'm ready to go to bed. Hey.